Hey there, everyone. It is Kim Krumpus, and I want to welcome you and thank you again for listening, taking time out of your day to listen to this quick, short video. Today, I want to talk about the incredible markets that we've had this past week. And in particular, Thursday of this week was just over the top with trading opportunities in the New York session. Remember, I focus on the New York session. Kevin, our London specialist, handles our members, traders, for the London session. The London session did not really move. And so this morning when we came in to start the New York session, it was pretty much range bound markets. But those range bound markets opened up and they opened up in a big way. Let's go out to the charts. You'll see what I'm talking about. You are looking at a chart of the Australian dollar. And what I want to talk about is the entry setup. Overnight during the Asian session, price action was ranging. There were no trades during the London session. Price was stuck in a range. And I had an order to buy this break on either side. So I was looking to either buy the break or I was looking to sell the break. And what happened was on the 5.30 a.m. Pacific, 8.30 Eastern candle, price broke. And it closed just outside of the line. And you can see price started to accelerate up and right in here on this candle, I believe it was, yeah, the 6 a.m. candle is when I started doing the New York trade planning session. So I moved my stop up to lock in 10 pips at that point in time, right before the trade planning session began, because I wanted to ensure that I would at least have 10 pips on this trade one to one. And what this trade ended up doing was it ended up hitting my profit target, which you can see on this little faint blue line right here. You can see price hit my profit target and took me out of the trade actually during the planning session for plus 50. So this first trade was plus 50. I'm doing the planning session. I finished the planning session and on this candle, right after I finished the planning session, I get another pullback here and I actually execute another long and I'm targeting up here up at the next level price doesn't quite make it and I end up punching out of the trade for plus 18. So the AU this morning netted 68 pips. The first trade was really quick. Like I said, it was I was in it less than an hour in and out of it. I should say less than an hour. And then the second trade, it just wa price waffled around. You can see it took a couple hours actually before I was given a chance, but then I noticed I had gone for a workout and I looked at this and I went, whoa, something happened, but it doesn't matter. I was long gone out of this trade. This candle was 45 pips. All right, so that was a setup. Now let's go over to the GU. All right, so we are looking at the pound dollar chart and the first trade that I took, well, first let me talk about what happened overnight. So overnight, there was a beautiful, long, clear directional move short. I shouldn't say long, it was short. <laughs> and then price during the London session took that move away and ended up creating a range. And this range broke out, put in a clear directional move long, and yes, price came back in, but it was still worth a, what we call a one time to the downside. And I took this trade and it ended up getting stopped out. So I lost minus 10 on this first trade. And then I put a re-entry order in at the 20. And you can see that order right here. Began the trade planning session, moved my stop up to lock in a few pips. And this pair exploded to the upside and took me out at my profit target up at 80 for plus 60. So the net of these two trades was plus 50 for me on the GU today. All right, let's go look at the Euro dollar next. All right, so we're looking at the Euro dollar chart and let's go ahead and walk through what the analysis was. This pair was ranging during the Asian session, tried to break here in the London session. You can see price tried to poke through, pulled back, closed back inside the range, tried to break here again closed outside the range, but never took off and came right back inside the range. This is where we come on to do our planning. And at the time, this pair was ranging. And I was looking to either sell the break if it broke to the downside, or I was looking to buy the break. And you can see that's exactly what happened. Price broke through the high here. I had an order to buy this break. As I saw, price action across the board was starting to ramp up. 
And it was a beautiful accelerated move that actually I got in, I don't know, about 10 minutes before the New York trade planning session began. So I pulled a stop up to lock in some profits here. And as I began that session, this trade was taken out and taken out for plus 30. All right. So another good successful trade this morning, there were a lot of them and I'm just showing you three, well actually two and two on both the Australian dollar and two on the pound and one here on the EU. So it, it was very successful. And the reason it is, is because we have a duplicatable, repeatable, simple trade planning system that we teach all traders who come through the doors. Of course, it's up to each trader to execute on the plan, but once you get the steps down, the next part is obviously working on your own execution skills to bank some of the profits that you see that I was able to bank today. Remember, I've been trading for 20 years. This is, I can do this almost in my sleep. All right, so thank you again for listening. If you have any questions or you wanna talk to me, let's go ahead and I'll show you where you can reach me. You can always visit our website at PriceActionTradersInstitute.com. That's PriceActionTradersInstitute.com. It spells just like it sounds. Or you can email me at info at PriceActionTradersInstitute.com. Ask me any question you might have. Or follow me on Twitter at PriceActionKim. I hope you have a great weekend. Happy Easter to those of you that celebrate. And stay safe and stay healthy. And thank you again for listening. I appreciate your time.